Santiago Abascal, leader of Spain's Vox Party, is on the far right, but he may move center stage as Spain's kingmaker. No clear leader emerged in the last polls before Spain's election. They showed the conservative opposition People's Party, or PP, beating socialist incumbent Pedro Sánchez, but needing to unite with anti-immigration, anti-feminist Vox to gain a majority. That would hand the far right a role in government for the first time since the end of Francisco Franco's dictatorship in 1975. So who is Santiago Abascal? The real Spain is alive. It has awoken. Thank God. Abascal started out as a PP lawmaker but fell out with the party, partly over its handling of the ETA Basque militant group and other separatist challenges. Santi, as he's nicknamed, is from the Basque region and founded Vox to campaign for abolishing regional autonomy and parliaments. That struck a chord with many Spaniards after a failed bid for independence by Catalonia in 2017. This was Vox celebrating winning its first 12 seats in Andalusia's regional election in 2018. In nine years, Abascal has turned his fringe party into Spain's third largest electoral force. Viva España! So what about the other policies? Our neighborhoods are degrading as a result of illegal immigration and drug trafficking. I believe it. And the people who live in that neighborhood and who are listening to us believe it too. Vox is on the far right, vowing to return to Spaniards, quote, the things that really matter, on a nationalist, anti-feminist, Eurosceptic, socially conservative and economically liberal manifesto. We are facing a real invasion of our national territory. Vox wants to expel illegal migrants and use a naval blockade to stop them arriving in Spain. Though it says it supports immigration that meets the needs of the labour market or by those who share Spain's language or culture. It has vowed to repeal progressive laws on transgender rights, abortion and animal rights and wants to roll back climate protections promoted by Sanchez. Fox also says it would lower income tax, crack down on corruption, cut public spending and increase tax breaks for large families. Is Vox certain to get into power? My wish is that they join forces because I really like Vox's ideas. I was educated in a school run by nuns. My father was very Catholic and I can't cope with abortion. I handle that the worst. Vox doubled its vote in May local elections, but some analysts say it has exhausted its natural pool of voters and its share of seats could actually shrink. We would go back 50, 60 years to a time when a dictator was here, giving orders and doing what he pleased. That can't be. The PP has struck coalition deals with Vox in dozens of regions and municipalities since May's elections. But they have dented the popularity of the PP and its leader, Alberto Núñez Feijó, and coalition talks could prove tough. Whatever happens, Vox has fast become a fixture of Spanish politics.